Hello friends. In this video, we want to create movement restrictions for the bones of our character that we designed in the previous tutorials. As you can see, now the bones of our character move without limitation, which causes unnatural movements of our character. So for this reason, we have to create limits for each of the bones. First, I select the bone layer. I click on the neck bone with the select bone tool so that its color turns red. Now I select bone constraints from the settings section. I activate the angle constraints option and write the minimum and maximum constraints. From minus 20 to 20. I close this section and test the movement of the neck bone with the manipulate bones tool. You can see that now the limitation of neck movement is normal. Now I select the head bone and repeat the same thing again. For the head bone, I write minus 50 to 30. Remember that these numbers may be slightly different for other characters. We also test the movement of the head, and you can see that the movement of the head is normal. We apply movement restrictions to all bones in the same way. Now I limit the movement of the pelvis. I write the numbers minus 20 to 20. We apply the number of 30 to 130 for the torso bone. For the arms, I write minus 80 to 210. We consider the numbers minus 30 and 140 for the forearms. I write the movement limit for the hands from minus 30 to 60. For this bone, I apply minus 20, 20. For thigh, I write minus 50 to 135. Numbers from minus 160 to 10 are suitable for shin. For foots, I consider a limit of minus 35 to 40. Well, friends, now you can see that all the movements of the character are done very naturally.
If you are interested in these tutorials, be sure to subscribe to my channel. Bye until the next tutorial.